Welcome to Asia's 50 Best Restaurants 2019. Number one in Asia's 50 Best Restaurants 2019, for Dad! So that is a truffle? Yeah, truffle. truffle. Nice. So that's a Hokkaido uni. In the uni shell, the first layer, you'll find a spot prawn tartar. Sea urchin on top, covered by the foam made of muscle, and a shrinky cover. So recommended to have different elements together. In yeah. So dig in all the way. Mm. Next on the side, there's actually a uni toast. You fill your finger lines on top. So that's your second course. Um, let's start off with the classic, Chojuni classic, heirloom beetroots variation. Just of beetroots involved in the plate itself. Quite close to anything that's red, it's actually made by like beetroots. Next, we have a stachitella, buffalo meat cheese. Mm. Recommended, pick different things together. Mm. So cool. every bite is actually a different flavor. You also okay. be having a garden. So it's actually one of our new programs for this year. Um, it's all locally farmed, about 85%. So like tomatoes, peanuts and the dressing is not from Singapore. <laughs> Just the greens, yeah. yeah. But so the idea is um, a local vegetable, so like okra, green beans, mm. even turnips in there. There's rojak flour as well. So if you have rojak before, it'll be a yes. refreshing taste in there. That's the one? That's right. That's right. So mix it well mm -hmm. uh, and enjoy it. So all the ingredients will be right here. Right. From different farm is right in there as well. There also be a scallop from Chonam Bay, self natural. Cream fresh at the bottom with a little bit of horseradish. Variation will be to finish off. Rice cracker, 
seaweed butter puree. Mm -hmm. So recommended, have a bite of the scallop, a bite of the crackles together. Okay. Mm -hmm. the story. If you miss this, you need to start all over again. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'll start with this, one of Chef Villain's most iconic dish, the rosemary smoked organic egg. The egg itself slow cook for 55 minutes at a low temperature of 63.5. Lightly smoked with rosemary as well. In your bowl, you'll find a smoked potato puree as well as some chorizo. Lastly, I'll just finish off the egg into a bowl. So recommended, break through the egg yolk, have it together with the potato paste. Do not overnight it. Oh. If you still love the rosemary smell, just leave out the bowl, there's actually more at the bottom. So that's actually bouillon pesan, basically meaning prop cloth. Mm. Uh, what is this? Prop cloth. Bouillon. Oh. bouillon. So, pot knuckles, pot bones, ginger, it's very light broth. blue card for you now. So see it on the skin side. We have a bit of shishito pepper from Japan. You have the oxybrew prawn and a bit of uh, spear the squid. We finish with a sauce now. It's based off a bit of mussel juice and flavored with saffron. crispy belly mm. and the red minute the gary ikastuit aussi blue prawn and chichito pepper from japan and then iranian saffron velouté so basically we make a fish soup mm. and fill with saffron and dinner thank you so much thank you. So one uh, selection, you can pick four cheese on a trolley. Hard cheese at the back and blue cheese. So any particular flavors that you like? Or? Uh, hot cheese, we have the blue cheese. So if you do... Kind of over here, uh, a cheese is one of my favorites. It's a Comte, which has been aged for 36 months. Beautiful flavors. Yeah. With the tea. You can have that. Yes? You want goat cheese? No, no goat cheese. Pumina no, no, no. is called Pont Levec from okay. Normandy. Much more buttery. Okay, I don't have that. No blue cheese in So no, no, no goat, no blue. <laughs> <laughs> Too strong for us. Can, can we have the blue cheese? Okay. So I feel like that one of the, uh, the milders will be the Pont so okay. easy to enjoy. Which one? I think it's a Salé Tradition from Chantal, from Chef Région, uh, very aromatic flavor. And this one? It's very interesting, it's called the uh, Trappe de Chauignac, which is a cow's milk washed with walnut liquor. Oh, cow's milk. Oh. Cow's milk. Yeah, yeah. Cow's milk. Cow, is, cow is fine. Yeah.
So this is free dessert before your main dessert. Eh? On top we have a lemon bun foam following the virgin sobe. Underneath we are serving fresh grapes and great granita. Wow, thank, thank you. you. So let's start off with the honey. Wow. Uh, the bottom we have a uh -huh. chocolate and even when it goes with uh, piccanuts for different kind of textures as well as butter, honey ice cream and finish off with uh, honey. Mm -hmm. It's actually from Luka. There's a farm in uh, Sambawang as well as Malaysia. Next we're having a uh, one of classic dessert as well for the shape wise. Uh, yuzu tart. The bottom oh. has a sable baton with a variation of yuzu. For itself, also made of yuzu sake. Mm. And in the middle, you can find bases. So try digging every layers together. Mm. Like how you cut down the cake. What's wrong? So it's a very traditional dessert, uh, making use of um, meringues and ice cream. But this time round, it's a little bit different. There'll be some peach flavor in there. Um, almonds um, at the bottom, a little bit of Almost crumb in the bottom, a bit of crunchy texture. Um, cranberries. And this sauce to finish off. So, not to waste anything, the leftover of three minutes of peach is actually made into the sauce itself. Enjoy! This is frozen strawberry lollipop with white chocolate. Just go ahead. The grape is melon from Shijoka. Wow. Plus, you have Tonka Pinta chocolate. So, suggest you start from frozen and hot because we're melting very fast. Hi there. Hello. How's it going? Yeah, bye bye. We're good. Hi. How are you? Thank you for the. How was the lunch?